All right, so today for writing, you are going to be working on your book. So get out your writing. If you know what you're doing, get started right away. Um, we are in the final stretch of our information writing unit. So you should be to a point where you are getting your book ready to publish or in the process of publishing it. That means you're getting it into its final form that you're going to present um, as your final work for this unit. Uh, I wanted to show you some completed work that's been done by other students um, just to give you some ideas, all right? So today I'm gonna to share the guide on babysitting by Kayla. And she says here on the front cover, book includes a gallery by author. Pretty cool. So here is, she's included a dedication page, which is kind of a nice feature. So dedicated to Miss Bollett or Bollett. I don't know how you pronounce that. My mom, my dad, my sisters, and to all families and friends. Wow. And here is her, um, her title page, The Guide on Babysitting. And here's her table of contents. So she has listed hers as chapter one, introduction, chapter two. Um, I'm not sure what that says. Dressing, making a bottle, dancing games, playing games, 10 mistakes you shouldn't make about the others and gallery. And she's got her page numbers in there and she's done a nice job of decorating up her table of contents. And then you can see here's her intro. In this book, you will learn some good parts and bad parts about babysitting. You will also learn how to feed a baby, a bottle and lots more. After you finish reading this book, you'll have a superstar babysitting service. So get ready. Pretty cool. So she has given us in this intro, she's prepared the reader for what we're going to learn about and what we're going to get at the end of this book. So great introduction. And she's included some diagrams here, options on t-shirts, pants, shoes, socks. Oh, outfits. I bet that's what that is. So putting together outfits is easy. The first thing to do is to find a top, bottom, and a bottom that match. So she's giving some ideas on how to get the kit dressed, how to actually do the dressing, making a bottle. So you can see here that she has is following her table of contents and she's writing out her different um, parts to her book. She's including some diagrams. Look at this great diagram on a bottle. She's including things that you do to entertain. So here's dancing games, playing games, uh, mistakes you shouldn't do. I really wanted to see this part. So never take a eye off them. <laughs> never be super mean. Never tell them that there is a monster under their bed. Good idea. Never put them to bed without reading them a bedtime story. Never put them to bed without a bottle. Never be strict, never be bossy, never be mean, never describe the monster. <laughs> and never scare them. And then she's got a little page about the author. Oh, and look, she's got an end page in her book. You know those, those things on the back cover that we have in some of our books where it kind of gives a little friendly little thing to all the readers, a little note to readers, for all readers, a note from others. Whatever you do, keep on reading. It will give you lots and lots of ideas for your writing. Thank you for reading my book, your friend, Kayla. All right. So Kayla did an awesome job. This is a beautifully done book. That is just an idea of yours may look somewhat like this or yours might be totally different, but I wanted to give you an idea of what to do. All right, there you go.